Hey, what's the tea? It's me, Curtis. It's me, Get Fun, on Twitter. Um, you can follow me on Twitter. You could Facebook me. You could do anything. I don't mind. Befriend me on here. It's cool. I'm cool with it. <laughs> I actually accept a lot of people's friends, but that's beyond the point. First agenda item is what's the tiger? And first agenda item is congratulations, Johnny Pixel 7, for being on 5AG. Um, it's been a long time coming. I've always thought, man, this guy needs on 5AG. It should be called 6AG. Johnny Pixels, you've always been the 6th AG in my heart. We here on What's the Tiger are kicking off a series about race. And I got this idea from watching five black guys who are also really awesome, by the way. They should be called five awesome black guys. But um, that's beyond me to choose their name. <laughs> well, anyways, I was watching another remixes video recently, and he was commenting about the stature of race and the treatment of people who are lower on the totem pole. You know, like, quite frankly, the higher status people are always white men. The right below them is white women, right? And right below them possibly may be white gay men and then white gay women. And the list goes on and on and on. But definitely at the bottom are black gay men. Or possibly at the bottom is black transvestite men or trans anything men or transgendered men or cross-dressing men or whatever. But the, the point is alternative lifestyle black men are at the bottom of the totem pole and when he said that i was like oh my god my best friend is at the bottom of the totem pole we should talk about this on our channel we this should definitely get more publicity this is something that needs to be out there not only in the gay community in the black community um in all communities <laughs> So, the series we're kicking off about race is going to be one question at a time, and we're just going to concentrate specifically. We're going to give detailed answers to the questions that we ourselves make up. Um, and so the first question is, what's it like having a best friend who is black slash white? Like for you, Dante, the question is going to be, what's it like having a best friend who's white? And for me, it's, what's it like having a best friend who's black? He's great fun. He's himself. He loves everyone. He's accepted me for all of the quirks that I have. Um, even when I was stupid, <laughs> when I say stupid things and when I have said stupid things in the past, he just kind of is like, oh, that's my best friend. You know, and... Um, I don't know, he's a real people person. Okay, so, so that's all what's it like. And he's really generous. And does he get anger? Sure, he gets angry really easily. He has a long cord before he gets angry. He has a really long fuse before he gets angry. But he gets damn angry, that's for sure. Damn annoyed really fast. Okay, so, after saying all what's it like to have a best friend, after all those things I just mentioned, couldn't anyone have those attributes? I mean, go back to the question now and say, what's it like to have any best friend, right? Go back to that same question, any any kind of best friend. I hope you would have answered the same answer, that they're fun, spontaneous, that they can get angry, that they can have a temper. I mean, these are, these are attributes of anyone, not just attributes of a black person. Does he like chicken? Yeah, he likes chicken, but god damn it, the world doesn't like their damn chicken. Come on now. Um, and, well, what's it like to have any best friend? Quite frankly, it's great. It's awesome. The N-word. <laughs> Coming soon to a YouTube near you, the N-word. <laughs> so, yeah, I hope that... 
Dante has a really good response to this video because what's it like to have a white best friend, Dante? What have you noticed in my being that would make me your best friend? So comment, rate, post, subscribe, do what you do, share this on Facebook, share it on Twitter, do what you do, you know? Um, it's a beautiful day finally. I mean, look at, look at that sunshine out here in Cali.